In the heart of downtown Shreveport, a multi-million dollar renovation is in the works. We have a developer out of New Orleans who's taken this beautiful building and the two next to it. Shreveport Downtown Development Director Liz Swain says that this building was constructed in 1924. It's been called many things through the years, but perhaps most famously, the Feeblemans Building and the Sears Building. But the building that's been bricked up and vacant for over 30 years will now serve a new purpose, solving a problem for downtown Shreveport. We have people lined up wanting to live downtown and we have no place to put them. The 70,000 square foot building will be transformed into 50 apartments to attract people like Tierra Range. I actually could envision myself living here. Range is a student at Centenary College and believes renovating downtown is a move in the right direction. Because of the downtown life and because of all the culture in our area, and something like this would be a great way to bring new people in. Swain took Range and her peers through the building to show just how much history it has to offer. Okay guys, head on in. Swain says what makes this project so special is that it's a historical renovation. And with this building being so historical, of course it has a lot of stories to tell. And one of the most famous of those stories is probably the old escalator story. This was the very first building in downtown Shreveport that had a working escalator, but it only went up. There was a line wrapped around the entire block waiting to ride the escalator. As story has it, several people were literally overcome with excitement fainted, actually passed out from the excitement that day that they were able to ride the escalator. And those stories made a huge impact on Range, who was asking where to sign up. It's so perfect. I could already envision myself staying here. In Shreveport, Clay Oster, KSLA News 12.